A well-known entertainer pulled over on I-85, driving more than 100 miles per hour in a Bentley. But police say it's what he did next that got him into more trouble. 11 Live's Joe Hankey explains why Rodriguez Broadnax, better known by his stage name of Jack Keese, is following several charges. With music videos on YouTube, including one with 55 million plus views, millions of followers on Instagram and hundreds of thousands following him on Twitter, Rodriguez Broadnax, a.k.a. Jacques, is used to fans watching him. Early this morning, it was not a fan, but an Atlanta police officer following and even chasing Broadnax down on 85 northbound. In most cases, if you're driving extremely recklessly on the interstate, you're going to probably go to jail for that. APD Sergeant John Chafee says an officer clocked Broadnax driving 116 miles per hour in a 55 mile per hour zone at 3 in the morning. The officer pulled him over but said Broadnax kept driving on the shoulder before stopping. As Broadnax drove on the side of the road, the officer says the singer threw something out the window. The officer picked it up in an APD report shows Broadnax admitted to throwing marijuana out on the side of the road. He took the driver into custody at that point. And a search of the vehicle revealed another uh, three grams of marijuana that was inside the vehicle in possession of the passenger. Broadnax and his passenger were booked into the Atlanta City Jail. Inside the city of Atlanta, officers are able to write a citation instead of arresting someone for possessing less than an ounce of marijuana. For APD, though, the specifics of each case are important. What we're going to look at is the totality of circumstances. So we've got somebody driving uh, way over the posted speed limit. Uh, then being deceitful with his actions, throwing an item outside the window. So while marijuana alone did not put Broadnax in jail, he is now being charged with possessing a controlled substance, plus speeding and reckless driving. It is the singer's third trip to jail this year. In March, police in Miami arrested him for disorderly conduct, and earlier this month, Broadnax was arrested in Milwaukee once again for disorderly conduct. As we said in the story there in Atlanta, instead of arresting someone for an ounce or less of marijuana, officers can give you a citation for up to $75, but you can still be arrested for that amount of marijuana. It just depends on the case. That is why APD told me today it is not it is in your best interest to not throw it out a car window or attempt to hide it when stopped by an officer because that could end up backfiring on you. Jeff. <laughs>